That's a good question. A lot of attachments come with different packages, and some of them are specialty, so they'll handle specific situations that you need. Uh, if you have those situations, it's going to be a huge help. Uh, one thing I notice a lot is people with pets, they need to have a spinning brush roll hand tool. That means something that's driving a spinning brush inside there helps lift the pet hair off of the areas that they're trying to clean. That can be a big help, especially if you've got a lot of shedding pets. Um, other than that, the, the tool that people use the most is the crevice tool. That's the one you put on there, has the directed suction. You can use that for edging along your corners. You also use it for uh, getting you know, up, in, up in the different sp spots when you reach up into the ceilings. Uh, the next one people use the most is the, the uh, dusting brush, which is going to have like a soft bristle on it that helps just get dust off of items. Um, and the upholstery tool is probably last, where people are actually vacuuming upholstery for what, whatever reason. And you know, if there's, there's lint and there's things like that on there, maybe some visible dirt, and you want to use that upholstery tool. So uh, people also use the spinning brush hand tool for stairs. Other than that, everything becomes really specialty at that point. Um, I always like to think that if you have the tools, it's best to have them and not use them in case for that time that you need them. Uh, so it's not really a huge thing. If you want to just save some money and you know that you're specifically going to probably use two of these tools, then go ahead and get a smaller package and uh, you, know, you can add the other ones later if you want to.